got a splinter. Ow, I've got no splinter. Ow, but that really hurts. It's like it must have been bitten by something. Oh, yeah. What is wow, it? look at that, a scorpion. Hello, and welcome back to another update from Australia on I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. Now, last night saw Matt Hancock in a very unfortunate situation, and this time it wasn't in a trial. So Matt was looking through his, his clothes, and he yelped quickly, um, and he thought he had a splinter. But when he had a little look at his jacket, he saw a scorpion was actually on his clothes. You okay? Oh, oh okay. It, oh. it hurts a lot. And I'm feeling slightly dizzy. Yeah. OK, um, sit, 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 sit. So I was like, right, get the first aid box out, get me an iodine wipe, sit down, we'll wipe it down. He looked like he wanted to cry. Oh, that hurts. And we understand from last night that Matt was taken to the medical team, he was checked over, luckily he was absolutely fine. So Matt then had to do the House of Horrors trial, which was a giant doll's house, um, and he had to crawl through different rooms to locate the stars. Now there were three stars in each room. See, Matt's phobia is snakes. Now there were a lot of snakes in this room, one of which was not particularly keen on him and lunged at him. Um, but luckily the trial was over very shortly then, um, and he actually got nine out of 11 stars for camp, which was pretty good considering he had already got a scorpion sting that morning and was in a room full of snakes, which are his worst nightmare. Oh, this snake is not a happy one. Very slowly. 30, 30 seconds. seconds. OK. OK. <gasps> and then back in camp, there was another twist, and Chris Moyles announced this, and the public have been voting for who they want to be camp leader um, and the two with the most votes were Matt Hancock and Mike Tyndall. Um, so Matt and Mike then had to choose a deputy each. Uh, Matt chose Charlene and Mike decided to choose Sue Cleaver. The first team to turn on all their lights will become the leader and deputy of camp. It only dawned on me about 35 seconds ago that if I went home and I lost to Matt Hancock I would be in so much we're definitely the underdogs. No, 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 no. Did you go into the leadership contest thinking you were the underdog? Yeah. Well, that's why you lost. <laughs> now, the four of them then had to go head to head for who it would then be the new camp leader and deputy. Um, and they were tasked with a, there was a wall of lights. Um, Matt and Mike were blindfolded. Sue and Charlene then had to instruct them to try and make sure all the switches were on. Um, and it was very stressful. Obviously, Sue and Charlene were having slime poured all over them while they were trying to direct the two who were blindfolded. Um, but Matt won, um, so that made Matt and Charlene the new camp and um, deputy.